Steel Army, DeAndrox7 here, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Anime Episode Reviews. Today we're going to be reviewing Pokemon Journeys Episode 72, Shuffle Panic in the Underground Labyrinth. Also, I know you guys see this little stain on my shirt. I promise you it's just water. I was drinking some water and it kind of spilled on me, and I promise you guys, it's no, it's not sweat or anything. It's just water. I'm not dirty. I, I, I guarantee y'all. Also, a couple minor spoilers for this episode. So here's your warning if you watch the dub. Now let's go over a couple of our major events. Ash and Go visit Unova again while Chloe visits the region for the first time. Go tries and fails to catch a Seismitoad, and Go catches a Durant. Now on to the full review. This episode, after a group of relatively important storylines, ended up bringing us to a reasonably low-key adventure, with Ash, Go, and Chloe ending up involved in a very small Team Rocket tussle in Driftvale City, ending up with the trio getting lost within the underground maze with a shuffled set of partners. To talk first of the great things, however, I quite enjoyed Chloe's presence, as whether or not this is ultimately a minor episode, her being involved is often much appreciated, more so for the way it showcases her being much happier about traveling and enjoying herself, a small thing that previous episodes already showed but which is nice to reiterate, more so because the contrast between Chloe being happy, finding some souvenirs at Driftvale City Market, and Ash and Go's disappointment that they went all the way to Unova by mistaking a publicity stunt for a real new evolution of the clink line was an amusing brief subversion of their typical dynamic. Those were overall solid ideas and good points of the episode. Unfortunately, the main problems with it all are the execution, the largest of which bring... Unfortunately, the main problems with it all are the execution, the largest of which being that some funny moments aside, this episode is incredibly restrained for a shuffled episode, barely capitalizing on its concept except for fleeting moments, and there is really not much to mention about it given the backbone of the story development is just tangentially associated with the shuffle itself, with the group being reunited by the Durant and handled by the Heatmore brought in by Grookey, making the entire episode feel like a series of disjointed scenes to an arguably higher degree than even Morpeko's episode. And speaking of him, it had been a tad disappointing to see its debut as a Pokemon involved both. It has not changed at all in demeanor from when it had been a pest harassing Team Rocket. And also spending the bulk of the episode far away from James, which makes me now doubtful the show plans to truly shift its role much until proof otherwise happens. This is only one of some seeming misreads of the episode, however, as Jesse and Meowth were both portrayed in ways in which, while seemingly accurate, end up missing a touch of the purpose of their characters. I actually hope the ending of this episode isn't purported to imply that this crush Meowth has on Chloe goes to be long running instead of an episodic instance like prior cases, because this first episode didn't give it an honest showing in my opinion, but we'll see what the future has in store for now. I don't particularly enjoy being this negative for an episode that I feel ultimately isn't bad, but there's unfortunately not much to mention for this specific episode beyond this. But with that said, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to smickety smack that like button as it really helps out my content and you know pushes it out through the algorithm and subscribe and click the bell icon too as it's 100% free and be sure to check out all of my other content but with that said I love you all and I'll see you guys on the next video only good chill army